Hi everybody, just a quick video about the LG P Lite GL310 uh, USB game recording and streaming device from Avia Media. Now, I've had one of these for oh, ages now, must be five, six years. Um, unfortunately, though, recently, around about Christmas um, 2019, YouTube changed their streaming API, I think, and the ReCentral uh, software that you use with the... Um, with the LGP light stopped working for streaming to YouTube you would get um, you would try and log into it and it wouldn't let you wouldn't let you do it and they 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 kind of fixed it kind of it does work now it's, it's a little bit different than it used to be but it kind of kind of does work so I'll put links in the in the description down below but basically if you go to the LGP page on Ava Media's website and then go to the um, uh, applications uh, part you'll see here there's a recentral version 1.3.0.120 fixed YouTube streaming issue the functions required net 4.5 runtime environment so download it and install it um, and that should get you running again now the thing that's different though is that what I found and this might be different for you but when you when you press you know you know here it's lot it normally says log in this yeah you, know, you re when you click on stream so let's start again so normally you've got capture haven't you where you're recording stuff and then when you want to stream um, you you you'd click that and then it would say log in and you click this um, and then you would choose say YouTube Live now I found that that doesn't work for me what happens is it keeps saying that my YouTube account isn't authorized for streaming. Which is a bit odd. What I found is I have to do it by the custom RTMP route. Okay, so now you may be thinking, well, that's a bit complicated, Rob, but it's pretty easy. All you've got to do in your YouTube channel, just go to create in the top right hand corner and go to go live. And then it'll open up your, your live window. And then what you have down here in the bottom left hand corner is your stream key i won't show you but you click on that to show your stream key and your stream url so that when you do this you put your stream url in there you put your stream url in there and click connect and then it will connect what you can also do at this when you're in here as well is you can then edit um the title of the video you can actually stream to an unlisted file as well which is pretty cool the fact that you can do that because that means that you can you can have I don't, there could be situations where you want to for example do some testing and you don't want um, you don't want the stream going out live to everybody so again you could have it as uh, as unlisted um, and then you've got channel members views now that's pretty cool because the people who pay to be a member you could have you could have videos that, that only they can watch and obviously be careful about that because people who could get annoyed but the fact that you can do unlisted so anyway that, that's really good I can change the title do all that sort of stuff um, and then all you need to do is you just go click on advanced um, put all your settings in if it doesn't crash maybe yeah. um, so for me 720p 6 megabits a second um, frame rate 60 I might put that up to 128 um, stream stabilizer I thought I'll probably change that to quality and then I have my USB mic that I'm using right now to do it you hit ready and then obviously I'm connected so it disappears and I would press F7 and that would start recording or you can hit the button on the middle of your LGP light and that will start sorry to start streaming um, and at this point then you could go onto your channel and you could you could you could watch it the, the tricky thing I find because I've only got a, a small old laptop I, I haven't got the screen estate to be able to stream um, and play the game because I, I tend to be using this sort of to stream uh, laptop games you know things using GeForce now and to look at chat so I'd have to have that going on my phone as well so there we go hopefully that helps um, I was pretty pleased with the quality that I've done a couple of tests I'll put links in the description down below in the second sniper elite test the audio starts to break up but that's because I'm doing all this over Wi-Fi which isn't you know the best you really want to be on a LAN connection 
Um, but there we go. Hopefully that that's useful. As I say, um, just remember don't don't go straight into um, YouTube. You want to be using the custom RTMP option and then taking this the settings from click go live and then check take this take the settings from down here. Okay, there we go. Hopefully that's useful. If you've enjoyed the video, hit like. If you want to see more of the same, press subscribe. And I'll uh, well, I'll see you again soon.